Soul there, and welcome to Shadowrun Returns, episode 22. So, before we get started, Mr. Washington in the comments has said that the kit I have looks good, but it might be advisable to get some uh, dock wagons in case we in take it to die, but get a couple and give them to the partners, the uh, assistants, just in case I go down, they can still revive me. Ah, excellent idea. So, also we don't really know if, if I give it to them, do I get them back at the end of the level? I don't know. We, we just don't know that. So it's a matter of... We'll find out this episode. So healing supplies, please. Right, so I need a dock wagon now. Uh, dock wagon uh, platinum will return the mate to 100%. Uh, platinum. Platinum. Gold it will do 50%. And a trauma kit will do 50%. Okay, so they're 50%. They're 25%. I say we go with gold. And get a, a 25 and, and a gold. What do we, how many do we have already? Because we might actually have some already. Uh, medic, 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 medic stuff. Advanced make it. I don't actually have. I have advanced make it. Wow. Right, so we need some dock wagons then. Definitely, yes. Uh, I'm going to get a couple of golds and a, a, a red. The reason is that I want to be able to get 50%, 25%. They will have their own med kits. Uh, you know what, I'm going to buy another advanced make kit, because why not? It's only two grand. We got the money for it for now. There we go. Uh, I have that. I'm going to get rid of this thing, because I keep catching this on me, but I don't really need it around me. Go away. And I'm going to bring a dock wagon with me, and I'm going to bring the El Crapo with me. No, I'm not. Not El Crapo. The, uh, one of the golds. One of the golds. With me, and the other guys will carry a gold and a Crapo, and if we lose it, we only lose a Crapo. And that's the real term for it. There we go. Thank you, Doc. I uh, will be on my way. Now, go and get myself a team to do the assault. Hey, uh... Hey, Mr. Delilah. Could you, uh, give me some, uh, some teams? I, uh, I need to hire a team for, to attack the, uh, brotherhood. Any, uh, anybody in takers out there? Yeah, okay. Now, this is going to be a particularly hard battle. I want to go to the better quality team, but these guys are really expensive. Compared to these guys, maybe 1800 on these, 2500 on these. Now, we are not that well equipped that we could uh, take loads of people that are very, very good. Oh, we actually have some John Bodley. I can't remove you either. Well, isn't that good? You have two med kits and some grenades. Can I swap those out? No. Okay. Uh, so, we need some people. We've got two spaces left. Uh, do we go with somebody from the big network or somebody from the cheap network? Um, you bring grenades to the, to the party, though. You, I will hire you. Boom. Welcome. Can I give you stuff? No. Maybe I can in the battle, but I don't want to give in the battle because in the battle is a bit of a annoying thing. Ah. Okay. I need the. I want the mana batteries. I want. The, I want them. Uh, Utility man is has these, and he has flamethrower. Two of them, and a drone. And a power bot. I'm sorry, but I'm going with you. You're not a proper mage, but you've got to man up with basically a power bot, which is a weapon, so I'm going to use that. You have three out of four fifty. Yes, okay, that's our team. Our team is now equipped. Let's roll. Yes. I couldn't actually equip them, which is quite annoying. So uh, we're not going to be able to equip them unless we're in battle, which is. I'm guessing that's probably one of the little sequel games that we can equip them ahead of time, but uh, I didn't actually have the option to equip them. So we have dock wagons that we're going to use ourselves, unless... No, 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 I can. I wasn't sure if it would let me do it at this point. Excellent. Okay. For me, I am actually pretty solid on what I've got right now. I don't need to build any of that programs up. I'm good on medkit, and I've got grenades. So I am good. Uh, here, however, I want to give you... Because um, you're one of my partners that you come around regularly. I'm going to give you the better one of them. And you know what? You got some grenades. Let's give you a. I got frags. So anything else? No. I'm gonna give you the jazz. Uh, no, no, I'm not gonna give you the jazz. Oh, I am. You're a shotgun. If we have to go close, I'm gonna hit you with the jazz. Give you some more AP and boom, boom with a shotgun. All right. Um, basic stuff I don't really need. You know, I'm just getting rid of the, the stuff I don't actually want or need. Uh, you are my multi-gun guy from distances. You are my mage with a pistol, so you're gonna and a robot. So you would actually do best to you would actually do best to have the actual dock wagon because you're going to be at the back with the actually the robot potentially and the and them so hopefully you won't be needed uh, but I will give you a frag grenade I'm spending a bit of money on this team this time round 
I'm zoning them up with other stuff. I'm going to give you the kamikaze and a frag grenade. Uh, that will do for now. Everyone should have a medkit on them. No, you don't. Oh, and, uh, and a basic medkit for you. There, I've, I've put a lot of resources into this team. Hopefully, I get those resources back. Ooh, what's that one? Who's missing something? Uh, you have medkit. You don't have a dock wagon. Uh, you've got the grenades. I don't need to give you anything else because three grenades is more than you're going to use. All right, we'll find out if we get those things back, shall we? End of the level. Dun, 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 dun. I hope we do because if it does, I really I won't risk giving my people some good kit. Whereas, if I don't get it back, I'm going to kind of limit what kit I give them, aren't I? Okay, here we go. Our objective is to head there. So I'm guessing we're going to get surprise on the way. Although this isn't a bad little place. Yeah, it's security. We have to blast our way past you. Oh, and a drone. Hello, you're kind of cute. You are. You're kind of cute, aren't you, little droney? Hey, droney, droney. Hey, droney, 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 droney. How you cutie? Can you turn around this way? I want to see your head again. There, look at that. That's a cute little drone. Look at that. Ah. Okay, here we go. Walking up. Team, follow me. Bring the flamethrower with you. Uh, here we can't go. There we can't go, so we have to go this way. A fan, eh? Marry me kill. Is that who? That'd be her, I'm guessing, then. Why are you on stage if she's a mean person? Don't know. Talk to the fan. Hello, fan. The fan is apparently excited to be in the same city as a rock, as a rock star. Hey, how are you doing? You here for Maria McCoy? Uh, you bet. Can get me in? I wish. I wish I could get in. They just announced this thing an hour ago, all spontaneous like. Of course. By the time I got here, the tickets were already gone. I'm gonna try and find a better spot to. Well, I mean, quite frankly, you know, spaces wise. Yeah. Uh, over here we have the security guard and a dealer. Ooh. Let's go and talk to. Bum, 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 bum. Can we sneak around this? We can. Oop, bit of lag there. Doesn't that go into the left for some reason? Hello, Patrick. How are you doing? Welcome, sister. Are you ready to build a bed tomorrow? I sure am. Why, why not? Yeah. That's great news. Come in and find the power belonging. Sounds good. Go right in, sister. Someone with the counseling center will be able to talk to you. Because you're screwed, I'm going in. Here we go. You hear sounds of some music playing within and made soft slippers going through the floor. Here we go. Oh, sister, I forgot to mention that everyone must enter the universe of Robert alone. Uh, yeah, I'm not leaving them behind. Uh, dun, 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 dun. My friends and I are together. In order to become part of the larger family, we must first know ourselves. You need to hear our message in solitude, and they can mind clear distraction and tackle the heartbreaking operative world. I have a few questions, because I don't want to go in without my backup. I give them kit to shoot people with. Um, okay. Uh, dun, 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 dun. Do you know Jessica Watts? Of course, Grandmother Jessica is the leader of this chapter of the universe. Okay. Uh, tell me about Lynn. Happily, Mother Lynn is a chapter of a dynamic spokesperson. She's truly an inspiration to us all. Who can join? Why, anyone, of course. Well, then they come in now. Okay, you go in first, I'll follow you. Be very universal and left alone. Wouldn't it? Elves are especially welcome to see. Uh, well, you might be an elf, but, you know. That minor stuck on, I'm going to shoot you in the face. <laughs> what is the Brotherhood? The Universal Brotherhood is a community that welcomes all forms of meta humanity with the mission of making the world a better place by helping individuals become much more than they currently are. Sounds like a religion to me. That's because it is. Damn it, I hate religion. Religion always in these games is like, ah, religion, I'm going to kill everything. It's always like, religions in games are always cult-level religions in games, aren't they? They're never like, just, hey, be nice to everybody. <laughs> After all, what is religion but an organised collection of beliefs that met relate meta-humanity to our spirituality? We believe that the Brotherhood is the highest form of religion because it brings us close to the truth. And the truth is... That's what you'll find inside. Come in and find the power belonging. Tell me about the truth. Gladly. It's something we're happy to share. I just thought you'd prefer to hear it from someone more articulate than me. It's that... Actually, quite frankly, it's better to hear it from somebody who's not articulate. 
because then they're not going to sort of lie as much. They're going to give you more information. Anyway, uh, but here it from someone wanted to me. It starts with the idea that meta humanity is a good at its core, and we all one family. But it's more than that. We are linked with some greater than ourselves, something beyond time. Uh, beyond flesh is the one I'm interested in, actually. You're going to have to go inside to learn more. I don't have an option to run away and hide, do I? Go over there, run away, shoot him from a distance. Damn it. Fine. Go to whispers near you. We'll wait outside for you, Jack. I'll take the team and circle around the building, looking for other ways in. i chirp you on the comic if you find one. I am better we go to that concert gets you inside, so I'll look around there. Oh, I want to go to the concert. All right, shoot people instead. It is. Dun 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 dun. If I find people in here together, I'm gonna be annoyed at me by myself. All I'm saying. All I'm saying. See, now this is a room full of people. If everyone should be alone, why are they together? Eh? Eh? Why are they together? Okay. Uh, what was that? There was text I didn't see it because it disappeared before I could read it. So we've got person over here, brother Mike. We have Sister Sally. Hello, Sister Sally. How are we sistering today? Hi, welcome to... The... You came out of nowhere. Hi, welcome to the Universal Brotherhood. I'll be with you in just a second. She turns to the other one at the de desk. Sister Monica, you have to be more careful with your ID. She reached down to the box on the floor. Here is a blank keycard. Take it. And your ruined card to prove over Christopher. He will let you into the office and program a new one. Following you! Thank you, Sister Sally. Of course. The truth makes us one. Follow her! Follow, follow, follow! Don't lose her! No! Good. I wasn't sure if you are going to disappear or stop for me to find it later on. Uh, hey, can I have a blanky card as well? I like the look of one of them. <laughs> Is Jessica here? I'm sorry, I don't know. I'll see, only see Grandmother Jessica at the special ceremonies, and even then only at distance. You might ask Mother Leanne, Leanne Telson, if you can catch her at the auditorium. Well, I'm not been asking if she's here, just let me see the auditorium. So that's fine. Why did you call the Grandmother Jessica? At the Universal Brotherhood, we learn that the world is one family. When you choose a path of belonging, you become one of the brothers or sisters. We are led by our father and mothers, who in turn are led by grandmother, Jessica, the Seattle family manor. Matriarch. See, I'm getting the even feeling that this is more cult-like, you know. Uh, what is Brotherhood? The Universal Brotherhood is a community that welcomes all forms of meta-humanity with the mission of making the world a better place for helping individuals to become so much more than they currently are. This is our Seattle chapter. There are more popping up every day. And uh, can I have a keycard? I don't know why you would need one. They're only used by the, to replace cards of the sisters who have damaged theirs. I damaged mine. I know. Isn't it exciting? I'm such a big fan of hers. The first time I heard Who Weeps the Children, I melted inside. Uh, don't tell anyone, but she's signing autographs out of right now. I know the elders will frown this, but I've just got to get her autograph. I mean, it's Maria. And key cards available to me. Da, 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 da. Key card. Take the blank key card. I will be taking it. I will indeed. Next to the desk is a cardboard box filled with blank universal key cards. You could get one and damage it. Maybe you could use it to get into the office and program a new card. <laughs> Take two, damage one, use the blank one. That's what you do. Take the key card. No one saw it. You saw nothing. Okay. So we're going to find this brother, what you might call him, and he was actually over this way, wasn't he? Because that's where she went. Aha! Remembering things. Sister Nancy? No. Well, who are you? Uh, you are Sister Wilma? No. Uh, there's a, there was a key card from a particular person. Uh, it wasn't Nancy, it was... Is it you? Christopher, yes. Hey, Christopher. I have um, a, a card. Uh, I have a blank keycard. Uh, I rejoice with you. How may I help you? I have a blank keycard that needs filling in. You should have a blank keycard. Yes, I do. I found it. Honestly. I'm going to get another one then. Dun, 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 dun. The desk is unattended. I'm going to get as many as I need. Also, you need to learn to lie much better. Can I? It was. There it is. Well, I'm taking another one then. Take another one. Thank you. Right. It said damage it, so uh, maybe I have to go damage it first. Bam, 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 b
run, 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 run. Hello again. Uh, is this the office door? Yes, but it's off limits to the public. Uh, yeah, I'm not going to tell you about my key character. You take it off me again, and I want it damaged first. Aha! We have to learn to lie. Sister Nancy, how are you doing today? Sister Nancy, hello. Thank you. Welcome to the Universal Brotherhood Counseling Centre. What's your name? Uh, I don't do names because I don't know. Ah, I'm Jack. I'm fine. You can, you can, you can know my name. You're not going to survive the episode anyway. Tell me something about yourself so I can pair you with the right counsellor. Uh, I lived in the shadow, so give me someone who understands my life as a runner. I would really like to talk to Jessica Watts. Can you direct me to her? I'm sorry, but Grandma Jessica is in the inner sanctum and cannot be disturbed. Okay, I already know why I call her Grandma, because she's just basically the person that sets her cult up. Uh, is Leanne available? Well, Leanne is uh, left the building 15 minutes ago. Oh, damn it. Uh, inner sanctum, please. Sure, you can currently you are currently in the public area behind it's what we call the home where the brothers and sisters live. Beyond that is the inner sanctum where only mothers and fathers and the course grandmother can go. Okay, thank you very much. And run this way. Dun, 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 dun. A lot of talking. I thought it was gonna be a fighting episode, you know, given my team. Da 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 there's somebody over here to talk to. You, you. Sister Wilma. Wilma 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 Wilma. You always wear these coats and make me think they're like the science labs. Hello, sister. How may I be with you? Boom. I have questions. That's why we're here. Okay, uh, is there a computer terminal I could use? No. We believe it's important to remove mundane distractions from our daily lives so we can focus on the truth and only computers in, are in the office and this is often just perspective members. That's perfectly fine. I understand that. But is there a wireless network I could access? I mean, is there a wireless network that could interfere with uh, my uh, piece? <laughs> Uh, tell me about the counter center. Just on the other side of the entrance lobby. Do you like it here? I love it. It's been part of the universe, but of cultage. Belongs to help everyone. We have a free soup kitchen that feeds hundreds of people every day, educational talks in the auditorium, and counseling center to help protected members. By the sanctum. It's a place of great meditation to only our senior members and others can have access. Uh, okay, so basically I have to get it in there. I'm guessing it's that door there, it says locked on it, and I got a terminal right there, which, you know, you said there were no terminals, and I see a terminal. Soup kitchen? Yep. So, ooh. Grab, 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 It looks like a maintenance staff. Staff, I left it here. Look at the tools. There's a hammer and a number of screwdrivers, a seemingly random collection of random crap, and tools. Uh, they can be labelled kerosene, it can be labelled one, and paint solvent on the other. Ooh. Dip it into the salt. Yes, that'll definitely do it. The plastic can care melts and it's, and it's solvent enough to be recognisable as a UB car, but hide it just enough so people don't know about it. Good. Also, can I have the uh, kerosene? Thank you. I have a feeling kerosene is going to become useful in the future for maybe exploding stuff. Uh, you. Janitor! Dun, 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 dun. Hey, Janitor. As you approach the janitor, he looks up. Seemingly surprised anyone notice him. What do you want? Just a little information. Uh, I'm going to pay for it. You look like you make a little easy money today. What do you have in mind? Because you're not my type. Thanks. Yeah. Uh, I pay you to talk to me about what the UB looks like from the janitor's point of view. I bet you see a lot of things here. I want to hear about some of them. From a janitor's point of view, what does talking pay? I don't know yet. Let's talk and I'll pay what I'm worth. About 50 new yen. Yeah, 50 new yen should do it nicely. Ha! i got to go back pushing my mop for real paycheck. Okay, then how about we talk first and then uh, how about we do a deal? No. Pay someone up front on no deal. Fine. How about 50 now and 50 if I can use what you say? That's about all I can offer, because apparently that's my limit. Okay. Okay. Excellent. Have you seen Jessica? Nope. That don't mean much. Most of this place is off limits to me. I need a computer terminal. Any ideas? The only computers I've seen in this place are in the office section of the home, behind the staff-only doors. Damn it. Uh, what does this place have access to? Hmm. I only have access to the public space, which are in now. Storage room, locker room, and the office. You have access to the office? And a locker room. Locker room can get ID cards from people's pockets if they're not holding them. 
because somebody may have done something like that. What is your access that you don't have access to? The brother and sisters live in what's called the home, which I've heard is the kitchen dorm rooms. From there, I've been told that tons of security protecting what the freaks call the inner sanctum. But I've never seen any of that stuff. Why do you have a person who doesn't believe cleaning in here? I mean, surely you'd get one of the members to do the cleaning. You'd get everyone to be part of the cleaning crew, you know, just make it part of the, the cult. I want to get into the office. What will your keycard cost me? There's no way I'm giving up my card to you because you're in trouble with the sort of thing that come back to haunt me. Okay, can I get a different card? Sometimes staff leave cards and uniforms in the locker room. Tell you what, for 300 new yen, I could let you into the storeroom, which costs a lot. Yeah, see, I just don't have the money to spend. Damn it. That would have been useful as well. See, by being that extra specially qualified person, I basically didn't have the money to pay him, so I screwed myself over by being better quality team. Thanks, mate. Thanks, mate. Okay, locked door there. I can't go in, which he would have let me through. There is a door here, however. Bum, 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 bum. And in we go. Okay, we have the father and brother Mike. You know what? Let's do all the talking this episode, and the next episode we can do fighting. Father with his greasy black hair and just that bullet red and black, and his swimming tattoos are quite a contrast to the flawless features and quite aesthetic clothing for Leanne. She's not here. She's left. It doesn't look the part of the spokesman. You can see the odd, odd, adulation in the eyes of those who linger around him to break into the presence of the moment. Apparently he's a charismatic speaker and probably a mage or some kind of spell to make it even more powerful given the uh, artwork. Welcome, my friend, from the shadows. I rejoice with you. How do you know I'm from the shadows? Please, I lived in the shadows for many years until I came to the light and fellowship of the Universal Brotherhood. I see you on the chains of, of guilt and sorrow, built link upon the link of the crimes you commit in the name of Nguyen. Ah, oh, we carry our own chains, don't we? Yes, and that's what I told myself for years, until the weight of my chains brought me to the pit of despair. But the Universal Brotherhood saved me. It can save you too, my friend. I'm sure it can. That's why I'm here. Yeah, we'll do that. We're going to play along, play, play into the cult. I think it's the best way of doing it. Because if they start playing bad, they're going to start shooting at us earlier than we expect them to do. So, ask and I shall provide the wisdom that I can. Uh, I want to speak to Leanne. Many are attracted to the bright light that is Leanne. But she cannot see everyone. What business do you have with her? Uh, she's going to help me come out of the shadows and into the light. Mother Leanne is a beacon that helps many come into the light of the universe. Unfortunately, she left the building 15 minutes ago. One of our counsellors could try to help you join the family. Okay, how about Jessica then? May I ask what business you have with Grandmother Jessica? Uh, I'm working to solve her brother's murder. Grandmother Jessica entered the inner sanctum and cannot be disturbed. I must tell you that the news of her brother's murder will not change anything for her. Well, justice, you know, help the people. When we joined the Unibrothers, we put our birth families behind us and divorced ourselves of belonging to, uh, to a larger. I know this seems heartless, but you may have had to understand that if you speak to one of our counsellors... Yeah, sure. Basically, you don't care about people that aren't actually members of the actual cult. I mean, if you cared about anybody else other than yourselves, you wouldn't care if, if it matters to her. You would care about it matters to the other people outside. There you go. I'm sorry, they sent me over. Uh, just answering questions before he leaves. Well, I've already spoke to him because he came through the back door, but... Who's Father Willy? Father Willy is truly an inspiration. After years of living in the shadows, he found a light about three years ago, and now a beacon for us. Yeah, he is. Yeah, yeah, he is, isn't he? All the brotherhood and sisters report to him. Uh, if that's what you mean. Ooh. Really? Interesting. Should have known that earlier. And he reports to... Uh, well, where's, where's the outfit in the family? Mother Leanne is the best spokesperson that she who comes from so much is willing to give so much to others. Is she around? No. Is everyone saying the same thing, so I think she actually might have actually left. Is Mother Leanne the same person? Yes, of course. But here at the Universal Brotherhood, we are one family and refer to each other as brother, sister, mother, father. So you're confusing everybody then. I'm not privileged to know where Grandma Jessica is. Well, we know where she is. But thank you. If you're not privileged, why would they tell me? You know? Uh... Alright, final thing we're going to do today is going to go and get ourselves this keycard. 
Bum, 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 Hey, remember me? I had that blank key card you took off me earlier. Well, I've got another one now. Uh, Sister Sally at the front desk sent me to you. And why did you send you? Uh, my key card was ruined and I need a new one. Do you have your old key card? Hand in the melty card. Wow, what the hell happened to this? Uh, it melted in the cold fryer? You'd be surprised how many times I've heard that one. Good, thank you. Uh, why are you out of uniform? Uh, I was working undercover in the Barrens. Who were you working undercover for? Jessica. As I suspected, you're not one of us. Get out of here. Damn it. Fine. Get another keycard then. Hang on a minute. Did you take my keycard off me? Uh, inventory, inventory, inventory. Would be that one? Nope. That one? Nope. That one with the gun on it. Inventory. Did you take my keycard off me? You did, didn't you? Damn it. No. No, that's controls. Mission. Ah, mission items. No. You know what? I might have a card. Can I open this door? If I have the card still, I'm going to open this door. If I can't, I'm going to get back another one. Hello, people. Don't ignore me. I'm just blowing up doors. Fine. I'm going to get another blank one then. Blank one. Thank you. Thank you. And this is case smart enough to recognize me. So there. Bum 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 bum. So but you're sounding like you crapped yourself at some point. Uh clean solution. Dip it. Thank you. And finally here. We're gonna do it again, and this time we're gonna say things. Not mugged. Mugs is kind of a weird one. Uh, go away, I'm not leaving to the office. Damn it. Fine. Pure will let me in. I need to find another way in. Um, I can't get the door, the problem. Okay, so I'm going to leave it here. If you have any idea what I might be able to do to get through a door or anything, let me know. Because uh, I don't have the money to pay this guy off. Ooh, 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 ooh. However, I saw these. Put the character. Yes! Run away, run away, walk away, run away, run away, run away, run away, run, away, run, 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 run. The fire door! Help! The fire! Fire people! Help! Fire! Fire! The comlink chirps and Cody appears on screen. How's it going? Good. I found a way off the limits area. I found Jessica's somewhere in here. You found a way in yet? Yep. I went down the alley and found a side door near the back. I'll send you the coordinates so we can find it. Excellent. Can you open it yourself or do you want some uh, help? Negative. It only opens for the inside. Okay, stay there. I will find it when I can. No sweet. Just open the door from when you're ready. Uh, it's this way. Dun 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 Fish contains many things, either brown or green. Okay, this one. Da -da 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 -da. So I'm not going to get any goods in here. So I'm going to hack this terminal then, because I am a decorous. I can hack stuff. Open the door and let your team in. Boop. Hello, guys. How you doing? You going to come in? Thank you. Okay. Now we're inside. So what we're going to do is we're going to move this corner here. And I got a feeling that when we go around here, yes, that door there is going to be where we basically trigger off the combat. Oh, 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 yeah, scanning, please stand by. Lockdown active. No inner sanctum security card detected. Intruder alert. Intruder alert. Security scanning, please stand by. Approved uniform not recognized. Open fire. Hey! Hi. Were you waiting in there for me? Oh, come on. Two shots. That's that for an opening round, really. You basically kill me in the opening round. Jeez, people. Jeez. Well, we're going to fall back to here where there's cover. And we'll come back for the turrets later. But, jeez. Uh, can I run back to here? Yeah, I need to run a lot further than that. But I'm going to run to there. Because I'm nearly dead now. 
And the rest of my team is going to move in the next episode because you know, they're going to fall back as well. But I have covering fire down that corridor for those guys coming around. I could have done me getting to these at some point, but didn't let me for these doors. But anyway, guys, that'll be the next episode. Let me know what you think about my uh, team. Do you think they're going to get killed and crushed and destroyed? Because quite frankly, that is a lot of stuff. And I am nearly dead in the first round. Wow. Anyway, guys, comments in the comments. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you next time if I don't bleed out on the floor.